Good morning. I'm coming to you with another Letterland review session this morning. So last week we talked about AR with Arthur R. And we learned that Arthur R. is one of the robot brothers and he steals Annie Apple's sound and doesn't let her make the sound and he just says R. The other robot brother we learned about was Orville Orr and he says Orr when he steals Oscar Orange's sound. So this week we're going to learn about three more robot brothers and you're going to see something that they have in common. We have Irving Err. We have Ernest Err. And we have Urgent Err. Now if you look closely you'll notice that all of these robot brothers are the same color. We have a purple, purple, and purple. If you look back at Orville Orr, you'll notice he's orange, and Arthur R. is green. These three robot brothers are all purple because they all make the same sound. Their names sound very similar. They all say er. So when you see I-R in a word, it just makes one sound of er. E-R in a word says er, and U-R in a word says er. So now we're going to look at some words and we're going to look at where that I, R, E, R, and U, R are used in words. The three sounds that we're talking about today are called R controlled sounds. That means that R is controlling what the vowel says, or in our case today, doesn't say. So that vowel does not get to make its normal sound. It is controlled by the R and it just makes one sound. Irving Er is who we have here and this sound is Er. We're going to look and you'll see that this sound comes at the beginning, the middle, or the end of words. This week we're going to be talking about short words, one syllable words that have the IR sound in them. Stir, skirt, here I have SQU, squirt. I changed my SQU to the SH digraph for shirt, third, here if you remember I have my Y on the end which is making Mr. E sound, so this word is dirty, thirsty, My next set of words has urgent er in them. Again, this is R controlled, and so my vowel does not get to make its normal sound. It is controlled by the R, and it just says er. On this word, I see ed, and we know that ed is a suffix. So if I cover it up, my base word is turn. Add the ed to make it turned. My next word actually has the same base word of turn, but my suffix has changed. Now I have ing, meaning that it's happening right now. So this word is turning. Here I have my ed suffix again. Base word is burn. The word is burned. My ing suffix, my base word I find is hurt. The word is hurting. Again, I have my Y on the end that says E. The word is curly. Here the word is hurt. And now we're going to go to Ernest Err. Again, another R controlled where the elephant is not getting to make his normal sound because urgent Err is, Ernest Err, sorry, is stealing his sound. So therefore it just says Err. We'll find that this sound comes at the ends of the words in the second syllable. This word is after, ever. Here I've taken ever and I've added the Y on the end to make Mr. E sound. The word is every. Winter. Under, over, letter, never, 
number, sister, mother, brother, father.